the wizard. Hello, this is Nanayao and welcome to my channel. As usual, this is a project update. I hope you're doing well. I'm happy to come your way again. So an update on the project. There is a lot going on. As you can see, uh, we are the lintel stage on the second floor and there's a lot of structural work going on right now. Um, there is foundation work for the fence wall. And for the fence wall, we decided to make our own blocks. Also at this stage, we're getting ready for the roofing. We're installing the lintel beams. We'll follow up with the casting and we should be ready for roofing very soon. For those who care about knowing the price or how much it's gonna cost you to make your own blocks, uh, the point is you buy your own materials and you hire people, maybe two or three people to do the uh, the molding for you and they give and take they might charge you around one CD or two CDs per block um, it's up to you to bargain and get the best price and as I said we are casting the concrete for the lentil beams and we should be ready for roofing soon at the same time we are laying the foundation for the Fence wall. So, for this project, we decided to make our own blocks for the foundation stage, the actual foundation stage, and the fence wall stage. We decided to make our own blocks. Um, the rest of the blocks we bought them um, from a local uh, uh, block making factory um, that's what we decided I mean we thought it was convenient and so that's what we did Again, as you can see, uh, there is uh, still still bending work going on in between the guest house and the main house. Um, there is uh, still bending for the dorm and the lounge area between the uh, main, main house and the guest house. For those who are about to buy iron rods and those who are about to start building 
Um, the price of iron rods, I believe, is about is more than uh, seven thousand Ghana cities per ton right now. Um, if you can, if you can, you can buy it and store it um, in a safe place because the rate of inflation is crazy right now. If you can do it, if you can buy it and store it, do it. And not just iron rods, any other non-perishables um, like cement blocks, um, wood, you know, nails, any other material that you can store for a long period of time. Um, cement bags, no, because I don't think you can store them for a long period of time. Um, but yes, go ahead. Anything that you think you can store, buy it. Uh, if you have the money, go ahead and buy it and, and store it. That will really go a long way to help you. finally got my staircase the way I wanted it, the shape I wanted it, and so I'm really happy. Uh, there's a lot of structural work, um, iron rods uh, for all the staircases, uh, anchoring it to the floor. Um, there's a lot of uh, steel work here. Um, even though it looks simple, it is not. It's a lot of work, as you can see. So yeah, there's a lot going on. Uh, these are hard times. There is hyperinflation. Every price is way up there. Everything is expensive. Uh, but that is not to say you can't do it. You can do it. Um, this is a time for you not to faint. Don't faint. You know, stand strong. Be strong. Okay, hold this up together. You can do this. You can finish that project. Continue and you will finish. Don't stop. Louisa. All the hard work as you can see we are ready to cast the concrete for the staircases
we also ready to cast the slab for the dorm area and the lounge area in between the guest house and the main house. Before signing off as usual, I want to encourage you continue with that project, finish it up, leave that legacy, build that house. You are doing the right thing. Until next time, this is Nanayal coming your way again. Enjoy your day, stay safe, and we'll meet again. Yeah.